Hello, I'm back again, and this time I'm taking a quick look at this video from Flatsoid. The Globe Defenders are trying to change how we observe things. First of all, they want me to plot a graph where the man is moving away from a fixed star. This alone shows that they are being dishonest, because it's not us moving, it's the luminary moving. Let's go. The whole deal with Polaris is that it's in a fixed position above the North Pole. It doesn't move, but I'm certain that we're allowed to. This is an 80 degree. Look at the altitude relationship compared to the distance, shall we? 80 degrees, 70 degrees, 60 degrees, 50 degrees, 40 degrees. What do you guys see is happening here? Then it's dropping some more. 20 degrees, 10 degrees, and eventually on the horizon, 0 degrees. What did we observe here? So you went from 80 degrees all the way down to zero degrees in 10 degree intervals and as you see it gets further away with distance that distance between the angles gets smaller you see the angles getting compressed together this is exactly what you're seeing in reality so what you're saying is in order to orthographically represent what a single observer sees from their perspective you've got to do a bit of trigonometry and yes even if mike is moving away you'd get the same difference only thing is you would see the bubble moving with mike where with the star it would be opposite say hello to mike here he is in blue as he travels south his personal bubble moves with him his bubble angle ranges from 90 degrees at the GP and 0 degrees at the equator and somewhere in the middle it's 45 degrees at 2700 nautical miles from the GP. Introducing Mike's pal Michelle. She also has a personal bubble dictating where she sees the star from her perspective. And like Mike, the 60 nautical miles per 1 degree is maintained. And now for the fun bit. What happens if I was to move Michelle over here and Mike over there? Let's have a play. Mike will see Polaris really, really low down. But Michelle sees it really, really high. So how is it on this flat plane that they can see it in two different places? It's up here for Michelle, but it's all the way down here for Mike. Very, very simple. We measure the angles in the sky. Well, that's it for this video, but I am working on something else. And this is a little bit of a sneak preview. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Tell me what you think, and I'll catch you later.